guess what y'all i just got my mercy tira kit club kits for july 2024 and i am rather excited about it i've been waiting i saw it coming all the way from another country you know i'm like right below canada anywho but it is from another country and that's fun so we start with this newsletter and guys this thing is so useful it is a color newsletter it reads issue number seven july 2024 so Tells you info about the kits. You have a great photo of the kit. This is called the Summer Lovin' Kit. Cute. Um, what else to tell you? Ooh, the color palette, journaling prompts, community spotlight. Great layouts from Stephanie here. Kit planning tool stuff. Ooh, these are my favorite kind of little bits. Are for sketching. Little journaling ideas. Don't forget the downloads, guys. There are label downloads as well as cut files. And then there is a sketch challenge. And when you enter into the sketch challenge, you have a chance to win a randomly drawn prize for 25 Canadian, uh, tw a $25 Canadian gift certificate to the Mercy Tierra Kit Club store. So, and it says, you know, all kinds of tips for using the sketch. Ta-da, that's the newsletter. And I need to keep the sketch handy dandy. And then I will work on that one first. So the kits come packaged in a really nice sturdy box. And we've got tissue paper with the cute little fox. And then all of these treasures. I cannot wait to get into them. Now I am a seriously lucky girl. So I think I got all of the kits this month. Let me see. Let me look at my cheat sheet. I received the main kit, which is the Summer Love and Main Kit, the pa the paper add-on kit, so the double pattern papers, embellishment add-on, cardstock add-on, and the small but mighty kit. Ooh, we have a small but mighty kit this month. Okay, so I do, sorry about that. I do get a sneak peek online, but y'all, it is seriously nothing like seeing the good good in person. And I mean, it gives you a glimpse of like, oh, what's kind of like the colors or the vibe. But until you get your hot little hands on these goodies, it's just not the same. It is not the same. So in our rather bougie baggies, these are like the nicest baggies I've ever had. <laughs> anyway. Uh, it lets you know the Summer Lovin' Kit. And because I am that kind of girl, I always put the date on it because I sort everything by date in my craft room. Okay. And then, you know, when you get the other things, like it'll say like the paper pack add-on, the, the small but mighty kit, all of that. Okay. I'm going to move the goodies aside to start because I really want to get into the papers and all of that stuff. Oh, there's another goodie to move to the side. There are goodies on goodies. Oh, and I can also get out the pattern paper kit at the same time. So I can show you front and back at the same time. And then you'll see why you need the pattern paper add-ons because you just do is the whole answer why. But okay, our very first piece of paper is by Simple Stories and it is called Summer Snapshots. And it's pretty. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna actually wear spectacles because I wanna see some of these details. Now, this background beneath the florals, it's kind of like the lightest taupe ever or like a bone color. And the reason why I say that is when you see this bright white right here, you can tell there's a difference. So super saturated florals, great like combo of colors from tangerine to aqua, mm, marigold, Gorgeous. Okay, clearly I get excited about scrappy supplies. Now, the flip side, ooh, it's a ledger. Okay, you know what I was saying? I was going to unbox these so you can see why you need, I'm petting it, the, the pattern paper add-on if you can get your hands on it because of this right here. Totally have to have this piece of paper, but a ledger I like to use for the most part as a full ledger. And now I'm happy. There we go. Okay, so that one is called Happy Days. I don't know if I told you that, but I'm retelling you. 
Okay, so this is from Summer Snapshots as well. This is called Keep It Sunny. And y'all, it looks like lemons and it looks like ice cubes with like little bubbles. I don't know if it's supposed to be ice cubes, but that's what it looks like in my world. And it's such a bright, dare I say lemon yellow. It is. And then the flip side, it's a gorgeous stripe. Example number two. Gorgeous stripes, all kinds of colors in the collection. It is downright fun. So this is the same collection again, Summer Snap summer snap Shots. This one's called Let's Go Outside, Clearly Blow Up Beach Balls with this aqua background that kind of vibes like a pool or a splash pad. So cute. And then the flip side, oh, how fun. It's a navy. It's a navy with perfect little dots in a row, but the dots are in different colors. Ooh, I love navy. So we have navy, navy, navy. Ooh, and a dot of navy in this one. I mean, it's all the same collection, but fun, fun, fun. Okay, summer snapshots again. And these are the tag elements. And the cool thing with the tag elements, aside from the fact that I just came up with an idea of what to do with them, <laughs> never mind, um, is you might have a really bold tag on one side, like the seagulls, so cute. But, oh, but wait you can have a different pattern of tags on the other side. So these have the tags at the top or just like a pattern at the top. And then you've got like a journaling spot, grid, whatever. And here you have like, bam, like full on decor, full on stuff going on. And if you don't wanna use a tag guys, you have four embellishments right there to fussy cut. And you have this amazing little layered piece right here you could fussy cut. So. There's, there are things that you can do. Did you see that bring on the summer? I would like that in a real shirt. Anyway, we've got the tags. All right, next we have got this one. This is from same collection again, and it's called Summer Stories. And you guys, this background, it is tangerine. It is tangerine. It is such a glorious, lovely color that we shall call tangerine. I love it it is beautiful it is pretty we've got this nice pop of like true grass green with it it is exquisite okay and the background to that oh my word okay it's the grass green <laughs> so you guys take a moment and we're not even done what i think i'm going to do though because we have many i'm going to shimmy them just a little bit so i can start putting papers here now our next piece of paper, which is hilarious, it is called three by four elements and it's got these birds, these seagulls, these little seagulls, oh my word. And they, I think they're seagulls. Seagulls, I don't know. They're the ones that go mine, 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 mine in Finding Nemo. Um, So cute and so fun. And they just are that wonky that they're hilarious. All right, the flip side to that, ooh. Oh, and this is called three by four elements. So our flip side is, you know, guess what? Three by four elements. So we've got this nice card, stay cool, good times and tan lines, sweet memories, hello there, sunshine, etc. Really great pieces to fussy cut to if that's your vibe. You may have noticed it's my vibe anyway. But as always, so easy to use when you're doing a grid layout or when you're blocking something out on a layout, so easy to use on a layout, pocket page, traveler's notebook, etc. Our next piece of paper, this is from Echo Park, Have a Nice Day. It is called Six by Four Journaling Cards, and now we have a total like graph paper, and it's in like a pale peach tone. Yeah, it's like almost the color of my hands. So it's like a pale peach tone, and the flip side to that. Oh, how fun. Big giant six by four cards. Did I tell you? Yeah, it's called six by four journaling cards. So this is a little bit um, more whimsical and funky. And we've got a low key like 1970s vibe going on with the flower shapes and the word vibes and all that. Super fun. The next piece of paper. This one is called Sunny Days or Echo Park, again, sunny days ahead. And guys, look at the saturation. 
Now we're bringing in some really deep mulberries, a little bit more of the teal. We still have some great, the tangerine is still hanging out, still hanging out. We've got reds that are hanging out, pinks. So super fun piece of paper. <clears throat> like it, I like it. And the flip side, okay, so it is a two-tone, so totally tone on tone. It's like a gingham, but guys, I don't know, like, it, maybe because it feels a little bigger, it feels kind of like a plaid as well. I don't know. All right, so this is from Simple Stories, Just Beachy, and it's called Let's Get Away. So we've got a map, but it's in really fun colors. Um... And I'm saying that because we've got the tangerine, right? That's in our other paper. But this deep, deep bluey pink and these citron lines are pretty darn cool for reals. And then the flip side to that, ooh, y'all, this, this, oh my. Okay, so we've got that tangerine color, but it's like light pink repeating um, palm trees. That's really fun. Okay, so our next piece of paper, this is from Echo Park, Have a Nice Day. This is Smiley Flowers. So we are a shade down in saturation. And this is like yet another shade down right here. And we've got these starbursts, I love, you know, like, like 1967 starbursts. So that's super fun. And the flip side to that one, oh, this is hilarious. We've got the smiley daisies. So like I was saying, we're getting a little bit of a retro vibe and it's adorable. You know what I'm gonna do on that so we can see it better? I'm gonna just do a flip. All right, so our next piece of paper. Oh, but wait, yes, that's how this stuff goes. It's like, and there's more. I want to fussy cut this out. Um, this is called Six by Four Journaling Cards. This is an Echo Park collection, Sunny Days Ahead. You've got a bright, bright, gorgeous white background with saturated florals, like just saturated, gorgeous color that I want to paint it. I want to cut it. I want to hang out with it. It's my friend. Mm -hmm. Love that. <laughs> and then the back side to that one. Oh, it's fun. It's fun. I said six by four journaling cards, I think. Um, look at these rainbows. Love that. Love just love. Um, squeeze the most out of each day. We've got some lemons and then we've got beautiful strawberries over here with this great journaling spot and I'm rather tempted to cut that out as an element. Love that. Okay, super cute. It's going to be a bright sunshiny day. I mean, I'm singing it in my head now. Here we go. Now our last piece of pattern paper. It is also Echo Park, Sunny Days Ahead. This has a gorgeous baby blue background with puffy clouds everywhere. Just so many puffy clouds. I keep having to shimmy my coffee over. And then the back side, and this, oh, the paper's called Fluffy Clouds from, from Sunny Days Ahead. It is a gorgeous lemony yellow with sweet little dots. So easy to use. Okay. So what I think I'm gonna do, oh, you know what? I'm gonna go like this so you can see the perfection that we have here. You guys, let me go like this and you can enjoy. Just enjoy, take a moment. What I wanna do, now the, the add-on paper pack, and I know I'm calling it the wrong thing. Let me, let me call it the right thing. Paper pack add-on. That's separate, right? It's not in the main kit. And what I want to show you right now as well, this is not in the main kit. This is a cardstock add-on. But I want to show you how beautifully curated the choices are from Tracy and Scott. Okay, so we have two pieces of apricot textured cardstock. And like it's exquisite texture. I, I'm a texture lover. It gives me so much joy to just feel a different texture when I create. So I get it. So this is an apricot. One side is, I'm not going to call it plain because it's textured. So that's exquisite, right? But this side has like a Swiss dot. This side does not. So if you look at how well that goes together, it's quite stunning. And then the next one 
It's called Buttercup. Oh my word. And did I tell you that that was Simple Stories? I hope I did. So same thing. You've got a gorgeous Swiss dot. And then you have got just a beautiful Buttercup piece of textured cardstock. So we have that. Max, we have two pieces by Basil that is, the color is called Potter's Clay. And y'all, that is sturdy, like so sturdy. So it's called Potter's Clay, perfect, great neutral. And then finally, we have two pieces of Basil cardstock in Avalanche that are textured. So that's what all the papers look like together. Once again, the um, pattern add-on, that's separate, that's fine. Cardstock is separate, which is fine and exquisite. I just wanted to show you because when you look at the possibilities all together, it gets quite lovely. Okay, so for now, let's just go ahead and leave the, all you know, both sides of the pattern paper. So we get in this exquisite little collection, a 12 by 12 sticker sheet by Echo Park in that Sunny Days Ahead collection. You know, it has that, that gorgeous mulberry in there. It's whimsical, it's fun. These little citrus slices are hilarious. The fun little sunnies. We've got some florals, which can calm my fussy cutting hands down a little bit. A nice little beach bag and iced, I'd go with coffee. Oh my good! Oh look at how cute, guys! This is scalloped, and you can just pop those little dots right out. Now sometimes you need something like these funny little sticker dots, like when you need a little something and a cluster, some hanging onto it. Okay, so we have that, and then for our alpha, we have a set of stickers. They are chipboard letter stickers by Vicky Booten, and they're white with with like text on them and then they have a little bit of a black outline super versatile super useful we've got some new merics and a little bit of punctuation awesome great pick now you guys i'm gonna have to get like all of the trays and things out let me see let me see let me see we have our confetti mix and i love that it you know, the confetti mixes even tell you what kit they come in, but let's pour this out and get a good look. I believe Scott designed this. Look at the little clay pieces with the strawberries. Oh my gosh, we have that kind of strawberry, that kind of strawberry, that little watermelons. I see an apple in there. Oh my gosh, look at that hot pink little citrus piece. Pulls in colors from this collection. <gasps> that is a he did a good job. Oh, guys, there's these other pieces. What fruit is this? Because I, I know like you guys really care. You guys, what is that fruit? It kind of looks like a kiwi, but not. Anywho, there's all kinds of fruity piece, pieces as well, of course, as these different sizes are sequins. There are like whatever sequins are actually called that don't have the little polka dot in them. So super interesting, bright, fun, and sunny. That is my point. Okay, then we've got this little goodie mix. We've got the goodie mix. You know what, I'm gonna have this tray out so that these don't run wild, okay? Let's see what's in here. I love these fun little like presents they give us. So let's see. We have got, all right, I've got some buttons and these are like, like a taupey or a natural shade with black on them. So those are fun. And I like to have things right out so I can see them. I've got a puffy heart. It's got a nice little sheen on there and it's fabric in poofy, cute. I've got some postage stamps in a different language. Looks like French. Little tickets and more little tickets. You guys, that is fun. Those, those little thoughtful extras are fun. Okay, and then we're still like in main, well, I mean, I did main kit add-on, blah, blah, blah. All right, so this is the main kit embellishments. These are journal bits by Simple Stories. That's what they look like if you don't like to see the whole shebang. Because then you can be like, woman, if you could stop talking. But then again, it's an unboxing. I unbox. Okay. I 
always keep these little guys handy dandy, but let's take a look and see what treasures. Summer fun. <gasps> look at this tag. It bumps out. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Tan lines fade, but memories will last forever. There you go. Jump in, cool off, like the green. A little camera. Be so cute if you put a little enamel dot in the center, but we digress. A little calendar. Look at how cute these little journaling spots are. They can kind of point to, you know, your whatever you want your eye to go to, but then you can put your little details on. Ah! Yeah, that didn't go well. A little tag and it seems to be navy. Look at this pea green color. It's kind of like the grass green color that is in the, um, which one is it? The Summer Stories paper. I wonder what it would be like to live in a world where it was always June. Hmm. Actually quite exquisite. The best time. Cute little bit with a camera. That's blue. He just came in making noises because he's not being loved on and given enough attention. You guys look at this piece. I guess it would go like that. This little banner. Cute little green tag a great place to be I'm so funny little popsicle loving this easy and breezy nice little florals all things sunny nice little bit there you can just circle which day it was a summer of fun summer fun days a banner, another banner, little seagulls, summer, hello, more of an Instax or a Polaroid. I think that's more of a Polaroid. Today was just perfect. Sunshine kisses. I love tabs. When you're like, what does this like photo cluster need? You just pop your tabs on. Soaking up the golden rays. Living in the green grass. I know, don't yell at me, whoever just started yelling at me. Oh, that one reads love. And that was the easy breezy. Nothing but blue skies, summer to-do list. Easy breezy. Then those last pieces that felt, guys, those are like watermelon seeds and that's hilarious. Another little tab bit that you can just circle the month. Stay in sunny. Summer tracker. Look at how cute. And then a little camera. Perfect. So that's the main kit as well as a uh, pattern paper add-on. And I showed you guys the cardstock add-on. So I'm going to clean this stunning pile of goodness up. <laughs> and I will show you. You guys, look at this. It's like holding treasure it is okay so the next thing to show you i've got the embellishment add-on and the small but mighty kit okay the embellishment add-on which one would assume will be exquisitely like spot on because it just always is so let's get yet another tray because that's oh and i say that i'll need two but we'll do one at a time all right, so we have an alpha and it's from pink paisley it's navy people ah, yes okay i'll calm down so it's great because you can do the perfect little secondary title you've got your big guy going and then you can do a nice secondary you know like a subtitle so 179 pieces they are puffy there's some numerics and alphas of course there's alphas there's numerics and some punctuation all right, so then we all got, I think, three frames. I think that's the way it was supposed to go. So let's see which ones I get to play with. Because I have myself a ball with the chipboard frames. Okay, summer memories. So there's that grass green that I loved so much. That's fun. I'm already starting to go, okay, so if I design with it, I can put in like a three by four photo. Okay, so this one is summer fun so it's more a little bit more squared and then I have a longer one and then I have a four by six so 
surrounded by like beautiful aqua seafoam color, which is my favorite. Okay, interesting. <gasps> I didn't know we were getting these. Okay, sorry. I calmed down. I calmed down. Simple Stories Decorative Brads from Just Beachy. There are 27 self-adhesive brads and five, oh yes, chipboard pieces. You guys, adhesive brads. Adhesive brads going on everything. They're going to be like covering it. As well as some gorgeous chipboard. Love the VW little van. My grandfather had one in a pea green. It was very cool. Like right here, it had a bed above. Okay, never mind. All right, very cool. Then we have got an ephemera set from Echo Park, Sunny Days Ahead. That's where I was grabbing a tray. Here is what is in there if you don't want to see the whole thing. Okay, but I do. So here we are. I've been talking for 26 minutes and I'm, yeah, just, just excited. It's fine. It's fine. I'd say I'll calm down, but I won't. So let's see. We've got a sun, sweet treat, life is but a dream. Sweetheart, I can't sing. Okay, limey color citrus, savoring the sweetness of the season, and that sentiment pops right out. A nice journaling spot. Hello, summer. Take it easy. Wishing you a lovely day. Every summer has a story. Go with a flow tag, and these little bits, of course, pop right out on the bottom. Although sometimes I like the way they look and I leave them in. I, strawberry summer. <laughs> I heard summer. Squeeze the day. Sunshine and fresh air. Freshly picked flowers for you. Oh my gosh, look at, guys, this one's really cute. The tone on tone, peachy tone. Life is good. We have a little ice cream truck. I want to soak up the sun. It's going to be a bright, sunshiny day. We're in the middle of a thunderstorm, but sure. Mm-hmm. Just roll with it. Popsicles, magical day, a little icy drink, hot fun in the summertime, a pineapple. Let's see, a big journaling spot. And then we have words, H, E, N, I, S. Mm -hmm. what's, it, what's it supposed to say, guys? It will read shine. <laughs> there we go. So that's the first ephemera pack. Oh, but wait, there's more. We have the Simple Stories floral bits from Just Beachy. <gasps> Look at them. Do you guys see all of the minty seafoam color in there? I do. I do. I do. And guys, we still have the Small But Mighty kit, which we'll talk about that in a minute. Okay. Oh, my word. These bluey pinks get me every time citron color leafy bits look at those florals a little hibiscus leaf flower a feather gorgeous artwork just i think these are mostera leaves or something like that more leafy bits we have got just mm, just like layered gorgeousness pretty pretty a little more stylized on that one so clearly, this is a big old pack of floral bits because they probably didn't want to see my hands cramp from all the fussy cutting I had planned. I will end up doing that one piece of paper though. I will. At some point. Oh, look at this pretty little leaf. It's a little floral. My daughter has um, plants coming up in her flower bed right now. They're some kind of perennial. They are a canna lily. And they're yellow. They look like that. So pretty. Gorgeous. These are the colors of my zinnias that are coming up right now. Just beautiful. I can see this color right outside my window as well as this color of my zinnias. They may have to get a little stirring roll because of this collection. It looks just like it. So pretty. Oh, 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 so pretty. Love the tangerine color floral. This is amazing. Kind of looks like a cabbage. Mm -hmm. Really big pieces. 
and then two more. So that is in the embellishment kit, and that's an amazing embellishment kit. And then finally, we have the small but mighty kit. And these are really fun, guys. These are great. A, to me, it makes your kit go so much further, but they're also great if you're into traveler's notebooks or card making and all that. Like, ah, they're versatile. That's my point. Versatility. So let, ooh, we get good stuff. All right, let's start with this six by eight paper pad. So you get the full paper pad, it looks like. Um, it's summer snapshots. There's 24 papers. Let's see. There's four designer prints and two three by four greeting card element sheets. Okay, let's see what this is about. I don't know if that's new or not, but it seems cool. Let's see. Let's see. I mean, to me, three by four is, could just be like for anything, but all right, let's pop in. Okay, so super fun artwork, big dramatic piece. And I can go like this because I'm fancy. Yes. Okay, we have that. Oh, but wait, they're double-sided. So we've got this really great check, looks like Van Shoes. And we've got popsicles. And then a really, 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 really skinny stripe. And this floral paper that we've seen. A nice navy with polka dots. And then this is gorgeous with this set of stripes and it reads summer memories, blue skies, green grass, golden rays, sunshine, kisses. I have an idea for that. The moment I saw it, I'm like, oh, I know what layout I could do. Starry skies or starry nights. Sorry. Sometimes I'm on my board. Okay. Oh, cute little cameras in craft. And then kind of a really cool kind of a ledger. Nice. Oh, we have this paper with the ones that look like lemonade, but then there's a gingham with slices of strawberries. There's that grass green paper and a really cute one that reads summer with banner pieces and a ledger. Fun. Then, oh, we've got waves. This one's leaning way more towards teal. It's super pretty. And here's that piece that has the beach balls that we have seen. There's that gorgeous stripe. Yes, and thank you. You are sunshine and happiness. Look at those florals. Oh my gosh. And there's a, oh, some of my papers just took off. I just saw this bumblebee and I was like, oh my gosh. And look at the ladybug. So cute. Oh, there's another ladybug. It's very buggy. Here is that tangerine colored paper. And this has those ice cream cones that were on that one piece that I said you could fussy cut the ice cream cones out. Cute. And then we have got a coral colored ledger, which is amazing. Now, three by four cards. Hi, thinking of you. You are so cool. You are one in a melon right there. It is. It's card sentiments. So clever. If you're not feeling card sentiments, you could be feeling birdies. And then we've got hope life is just beachy. Hello there. You're so sweet. Sunny days ahead. Cute. Oh, and on the flip side to that is this really, I mean, it looks like a bunch of washi tape, but it's not. Is that where we started? Is that where we started? Everybody? No? Okay. We have this, your so much sun, so little time. Oh, so much, not your so much. I'm still reading card sentiments, people. Help. So much sun, so little time. And you have a whole picnic scene. And then we've seen these. Okay. So that's the six by eight paper pad. So it looks like, yeah, they looks like you get a bunch of doubles and, or you get doubles and you get the um, three by fours. Okay, so now let's see. I know that we get like some, and I can't remember exactly how it's written, but let's just see. We get some of the alphas. So I've got this really nice creamy deep teal. I think we get two alphas from this. I think that's how it goes. Okay, so I've got a really nice deep teal, big blocky ones, and then little tile ones, and then smaller blocky ones. Okay, I like that. Ooh, and I have the mustard colored too. Yay! Okay, guys, I would have been happy with any of them because I just like things. Somehow, I find it to be more fun. And this is weird, and I get that I'm weird. 
when you don't know um, which ones you're going to get, let's say, let's say there's 10 colors and that everybody gets two colors and you don't know which ones you want, you're going to get. I somehow find that to be more fun. It's like a grab bag. It's, it's, I don't know. I'll stop. Okay. Then I think we get three of these sheets. So I've got aqua. So they're like typewriter keys, but then there's wordy bits. Ooh, I've got kind of a pea green and the wordy bits are different. Yes, that is so nice because sometimes you want to like layer up a bunch of words in all of the colors. So look, they're different. And then I have tangerine. What? So it ended up that I have like five different colors. Yes, I do. All right, scored. And then we get, I don't know if it's a half a pack, but we get a bunch of these Swiss dot on one side and then you know they are plain on the other so I have two of the teal I've got two of this gorgeous strawberry corally color for mustard I have the two for the mustard tone <gasps> I've got two really deep red and then two of the blue and then two of this deep grass or pea green. So I bet you get like half of it. I don't, I'm not quite sure. So don't, don't get all quoting me. But guys, look at how fabulous the Small But Mighty is. You have got like what we'll call our cardstock because, you know, you get Swiss dots. You've got this paper pad that has card sentiments and all kinds of outfits. Yep, I'm going to stop talking. I'm going to get creating, guys. And I will see you guys ever so soon with another video. Deets down below to get your hands on the goodies. Bye, friends.